Hey guys, it's me again, and today I'm going to be telling you my experience when I saw Spies in Disguise today. So yeah, so basically what the plot is, it's about this secret agent called Agent Land Sterling, and he's, and he's been fighting bad guys like he usually is. And then he's on, and, he, and then he was on this mission to stop the evil guy with a rope with the robotic head. I think it was Doctor Claw. I think uh, I am not sure. And then we have this kid called Walter, which I I can't remember his second name, and he tries to help Sterling with the mission and it's up to and it's up to and then Sterling turns into a pigeon after when he takes a drink of Walter's experiment and then he tries to unbird him and then it's up to Sterling and Walter to to save the day, and that's what the plot is. Sorry, I'm saying the plot like wrong. It's just it's a bit complicated. It's not a bad film. It's just I'm I'm probably not gonna be explaining the plot anymore because I'm just gonna mess it up. So yeah. So what I think of the film, I actually thought it was really funny. My brother and his friend Dylan were laughing at the film because they thought it was hilarious. And yet, and before we went to see the film, we went to the new arcade in Navin. The new arcade beside in beside the cinema in Navin. And we, we played a few arcade games there. And yeah, and I also saw my friend from the youth club, Jack, there. And he was also with his friend from school, I think. I'm not sure. But he was he he was there with his friend, which they were playing arcade games, too. So yeah. And I also got a few prizes at the end. Like I got some moldy, or uh, I don't know what those sweets are called. Yeah, I, I just got sweets for my raffle, for my prize. And I got, like, 14 tickets, I think. And then I got the prize. So, yeah, and after the film, we just went home for a while. And then I'm in my granny's house, my dad's mother's house. Right now, because we were ha because my uncle was ordering a Chinese for the family. Well, not all the families are. Well, not all of my family are here, but some of us are. Yeah, some of the family are here. So yeah, and I and probably my favorite part was um. Um, pretty much all of it. I, I can't think of any favorite parts because uh, I haven't seen this movie for like a few hours now, so I can't remember. So yeah, and uh, I think that's. You so, see, yeah, and I hope they. I think this film was. Originally meant to be scheduled for last year, but I think it was like delayed or something. I don't know. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, and um, I think this film was meant to come out like in fall of this year. I think because yeah, and um. Yeah, and I hope they make a sequel to the film soon because, you know, the movie's great and I definitely recommend you seeing it.
If you haven't seen this film before, I recommend it. So yeah. So I think that's all I have to say. So yeah. Oh yeah, and this, and this is probably gonna be the last. And this is also the, the last film that I'm seeing for this year because, you know, this day two days, the day after tomorrow will be, two thousand twenty, and um, um, I'm not sure what. What will be the first movie that I'll be seeing for next year, but it'll depend. I might see playing with fire next year. I, I, I guess I could. It does look alright, if you ask me. But I'm probably going to see it next year. Maybe, don't know, but we'll see about it. So, yeah. So, I believe this... And I'm also going to be doing my top 10 favorite films of this year. And I'm also going to be doing a top 5 worst films of this year. And I'll be also doing a video of the movies that I'm excited for next year. Which I'll probably do it today or tomorrow. I don't know. It'll, it'll depend. So yeah. And this is probably the longest year that I've seen the most films. Yeah, I did see a lot of films in last year in 2017. But I think I saw about 34 films this year. Wow, that, that, that's probably the longest amount of year that I've seen movies. Maybe next year I'll see even more films, but we'll just have to wait and see. See, yeah. <clears throat> and this is also the first year that I've seen movies every month. Yeah, every single month from January to this month that I've seen movies. Well, I haven't seen it every single day this year, no. But I've seen them every month, and they're re <clears throat> and um, that's awesome. So yeah, and I'll be also doing my review on two thousand nineteen on New Year's Day. Uh, I'm probably gonna have quite a lot to talk about. So yeah, stay tuned for the review in about um, two days' time. Sorry, I just turned the speaker off. It's just <clears throat> my sister came in and I didn't. I just told her to get out, but you know, I don't like people coming in when I'm doing a video or when I'm. Yeah, you know. So yeah. So stay tuned for the review of 2019 on New Year's Day. So yeah. So I think that's basically it. So yeah. So that's all for now. Stay tuned for some more videos. Coming up soon. And this is me signing off.